happy guinea pig! Here we go! Hi, I'm Al Ang, and welcome to my kitchen. Duh. And today I am making a dish for a very special person. I'm doing a YouTube signature dish for Miss Joy Stewart. And the name of the dish is Refreshing Watermelon Salad. And the ingredients, I have five cups of watermelon. And y'all will see that this is a yellow watermelon. It's the first for the piggy. Ain't never had no yellow watermelon. I love yellow watermelon. It's probably one of my favorites. Miss Joy Stewart loves yellow watermelon. So that's why I'm using yellow watermelon. Here I have a fourth of a cup of feta cheese, two tablespoons of blue cheese crumbles, a half a cup of chopped walnuts, a tablespoon of parsley, fresh parsley chopped, and a tablespoon of fresh cilantro chopped. In this bowl here, I have some mixed spring greens. It's baby lettuces. Uh, it's just a mixture of baby lettuces and radicchio and uh, possibly some arugula and other things that are in there. It just said spring mix is all it said for the baby stuff. Over here, this is what I'm going to mix up for my dressing or sauce or whatever you want to call it that would go over my salad. Uh, I have honey. I'm going to use two tablespoons of honey, about an eighth of a teaspoon of salt. I have the zest of one lemon, the juice of one lemon, the zest of one lime, and the juice of one lime. And I'll mix all of that up pour over the salad. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to add my feta crumbles. And now this is a very quick and simple uh, salad, but it should be refreshing and taste great. And when I first started thinking about doing these signature dishes, and thought about Miss Joy, this right here was one of the first things that came to my mind. Paint the butter when it was proposed to you. Once I started figuring out what I wanted to fix for everybody, uh, after it had been proposed to me, uh, Gary at Jailbait and Tackle Outdoors is the one that suggested that I do the YouTube signature dishes. And once I started thinking about, all right, who do I want to make these for? This is the first thing that popped into my mind for Miss Joy, was a watermelon salad. And the reason being, Miss Joy, if you've never seen her or watched her, and you really should if you haven't, uh, she is a little spitfire dynamite. And as sweet as she can be. She's redheaded. She's uh, from the Appalachian Mountains of Kentucky. And she is probably one of the sweetest, most wonderful, good-hearted women you will ever meet in your life. I have not had the pleasure to meet her in person, but I have talked with her in chats, through emails, uh, on Facebook, you know, and just, I've talked to her face-to-face -face on a live chat, and I just, I love her dearly. She's even had the misfortune to send the piggy get jiggy, and she still likes piggy, so she's got to be a good woman. So, you know, she is a refreshing personality. She tells it like it is and doesn't pull any punches. If it hurts your feelings, oh well. She's telling the truth. She's not going to hurt you purposely, but she's not going to lie to you either. And she ain't going to offer no band-aid for that either. Yeah. And... Uh, she is just an all-around wonderful lady. So, I love her refreshing personality. And that, that's, when I say refreshing, I do mean she is as honest as the day is long. And she is not going to take any guff off of anybody. I love that about her. All right, y'all, what I'm going to do now is I've got this mixed together. So, I'm going to take, I'm going to pour it in on top of this lettuce. Okay. 
And if you're wondering why I chose the ingredients I did, I love feta cheese. It just has a really refreshing flavor. And I have seen a watermelon salad recipe before. Nothing like mine. But it had water, it had the red watermelon and it had the feta cheese and um, had a few other ingredients. I can't remember. But this is my version of a refreshing watermelon salad. The blue cheese is simply to accent the feta and because I know Miss Joy likes blue cheese. Got it, Steve. Steve discovered he likes feta cheese, too. All right, now this is what this looks like. I'm going to set this to the side, and I'm going to mix up my little dressing that goes over it. I'm going to pour my lemon juice in here, my lime juice, my lime zest, and my lemon zest. I'm going to measure out my salt. And like I said, I'm not putting a great lot of salt in it. I know Miss Joy doesn't use a lot of salt. She does save in her face. She's an excellent cook, but she tries to stay away from a lot of salt if at all possible. A good so idea for anybody. Yeah, so I'm putting only about an eighth of a teaspoon of salt in that. I apologize for any noise y'all might hear in the background. Piggy's getting jiggy doing dishes. Yeah, Piggy don't ever wait till I get done before he does dishes. Which, that's okay. At least they get done. And you'll see, I'm just going to dip out two tablespoons of honey. And you'll see my honey has kind of solidified a little. But that's okay because it hasn't gone bad. It just means that if I need to get down to that, I will have to use some warm water and heat that up and turn it back to a liquid. And there's my second tablespoon of honey. Well, I figured as long as I got the camera on the action, <laughs> I can do a little action of my own. You set this back over there, Piggy, with that other stuff. Where's yeah, that? I got around the corner. Excuse me for using my finger. But right now, the only one's going to eat this is me and Piggy, and I just washed my hands, so I'm not going to worry about getting that on there. We're a married couple. Y'all yeah. know I ain't afraid of none of that. I that just, I just leave that at that. There you go, Piggy. I'll let you wash that for me if you don't mind. Get that sticky off of it. Yeah. And it just yeah, Now all I'm going to do is I'm just going to whisk this together. And you'll see how I've got it with. It just all incorporates together. Uh, and I'm going to take and I'm going to pour or drizzle this all over. Y'all would have laughed at Piggy earlier. He was cutting the watermelon for me while I was zesting my lime, <laughs> my lemon, and she uh -oh. and She going to tell him. He was cutting that watermelon and he smelled the uh, lemon and he said, it even smells like lemon. Yeah, I started putting my nose to it and like, what is this? I was trying to smell where that lemon came from. It smelled like lemon too. I, said, I looked over, she's sitting over there zesting a lemon. I was like, oh, okay. But it still messed with my head even though I even though I knew what was going on. All right, y'all, this right here is pretty much done. I just got to put it on plate for us to try and eat. And if anybody wants to make this and you don't like yellow watermelon or you can't find yellow watermelon, it can be made with a red watermelon. It just won't look the same. It just won't look the same. It, I mean, it'll look similar, but it'll just have red instead of yellow. And if Piggy will hand me my plate and take this little bowl out of my way. Will do. We will. Plate is not enough. And hopefully Piggy will get me a couple pictures of this as we do this. Da, 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 da. I'm not going to do a great big plate full. I'm going to get some of the plates, yeah. and I'll get some, one or two of that bowl. Well, if you can get the bowls and the plates together, that would work, Piggy. There we go. Piggy, 
go. Okay, well, it's going to have a little bit of you in it, too. Well, how about I move this right here? And I can pop it. If I'm in it, that's fine, too. I don't care. Y'all, this is what we do for you, too. Da -da 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 I just need one or two. I don't need five or ten. Well, I made three. Okay. I'm going to set this right here off to the side. And get my plate. And give Piggy his fork. Y'all know what time it is. Oh, yeah. And we cut the watermelon. It should be cut between a half inch to an inch or however you want to do it. I'm trying to get a little bite of pretty much everything in here. There we go. Oh, wow. Mm. Oh, y'all, that's better than I imagined. That is so good. Miss Joy, I hope you like the recipe. I hope you try the recipe. It is really good. Oh, wow. And it is a refreshing watermelon salad. And this is, again, the YouTube signature dish for Joyce Stewart. And again, if y'all haven't checked out her channel, please do so. Oh, yeah. And I, I guarantee if you check out her channel, you will fall in love with her, just like we have. She does some great cast iron kitchen. Oh, yeah. Cast iron cooking. cooking. And she has stories about her me, mom, and papa. And love those. And she shares videos of her and her husband, Scott. And he has his own channel as well. And he will be a featured signature dish. Uh, probably about in a week or so. So I do want to thank y'all again for watching. Everybody have a great day. Bye, y'all. Bye, y'all. Where's my boy?